Hello and happy Friday. I hope you guys are doing well and welcome to Fridays with Brandon. This is Fluke Fridays episode number 87 and today what we're going to talk about is a new product which is great because we have not had the chance to unbox a new product or talk about a new product for a while. I've been trying to be creative talking about older stuff but I have a brand new accessory in my hand for the DS703 FC and we're going to go over this new articulating lens or articulating camera and kind of go over it, give you my thoughts, as well as hopefully get some thoughts from you in the comments. So let's jump into it. <clears throat> okay, so my work table down here is a total mess, but you can just bear with me through that. So what we're talking about today is the DS703. Um, done other videos on this before, but this is a borescope from Fluke. A lot of people don't realize Fluke has a borescope. It is touchscreen, so you can dial through if you want to look at the memory. Um, you can also use the, the function keys if you don't want to use the touchscreen um, and various things. So if I want to capture an image, kind of go through that. You can capture images and videos, which kind of makes it unique um, for its price point. So uh, we've talked about this is this camera before. This is the camera that comes with it. It has both a forward-facing camera, and they both have lights on them, and a side-facing camera, so you can see 90 degrees. There are several other models from the Fluke portfolio that have a more um, more narrow diameter camera so you can get into tighter spaces this would be one of those but what makes it really exciting is it's not just the end of it right and there's the led lights and that but when you push this plunger we can articulate it so got a question for you guys that you can hopefully leave in the comments below um when i see this i know there's lots of movies that have these kind of things in it but the one that is a big throwback for me would be skulls that old movie, um, and they would, they would go up through, and they only used it in one scene in the whole movie, but for some reason that sticks out in my mind. So if you have a movie that you remember somebody using an articulating borescope and a scene that you really liked or stuck with you from either a recent movie or a long time ago, put it in the comments below because we want to hear about it. Um, but it's pretty cool. So you could drill a hole in something, obviously go into the wall, and then articulate to what you want to see kind of see that and I'll hold this up and try to get it a little closer to the screen maybe I can show you both at the same time it's easier said than done with limited hands but you squeeze this and you can see it rotates around so pretty cool um, what would be applications for a tool like this in the industrial application you might be looking um, in a gearbox to look at the teeth of the gearbox you can see um, very close it's really intended for pretty close resolution and you get really great resolution when you're um close you can see my fingerprint there nobody steal that but at a distance it's not really designed for a long distance you can see my tools kind of look out of focus but when it's within a couple inches it's very very in focus but applications you could be looking at teeth in a gearbox you could be trying to look around the wall do different things so some kind of cool stuff other things you know love to get people's feedback you know this is not a uh, one that is uh what's it called insulated so you couldn't really put this in an energized panel but if a company i don't know if any companies make them out there but if a company did make that would that be of an interest to people if there is put those comments below as well um love to get that feedback so anyways Really cool, check it out. Check out the articulating camera from Fluke that's new accessory for the DS703. I hope you guys have a great weekend. Um, hit the thumbs up if you like it. And also, don't forget, if you've watched more than three videos, don't forget to hit subscribe. It really helps the channel and it costs you nothing, which is great. Take care and have a great weekend.